next song is called Jeans and Good Leather, uh, first recorded by Chris Ledoux. This was the song that connected us. It was in right. a publishing company, and I think he went to this publishing company looking for songs. Right. They showed him this. Uh, this is the song that sparked the invitation to come out to their house. Um, and he recorded it in 1980 on the same album with 10 Seconds in the Saddle. And um, this is one of the two repeats for me on this al on this second time. Okay. I had it on an earlier album, but I never was crazy about the way it came out. You okay. know, sometimes you, sometimes you, songs just don't come out in the studio the way you hope they would. That's right. Yeah. And um, besides, it fit, it fit the concept of this album right. because every song on here was first recorded by somebody else. But um, I was teaching school in Nashville when I wrote this song, wishing that I could get back to Texas. And as I say, every time I perform this song live, sometimes we think, if we could just get home. Right. If we could just get home, it would fix right. all our problems. Right. Yeah. And uh, so that was the, the illusion. The yeah. idea yeah. that I had in my mind when I wrote this. Uh, I mentioned Kyle e Evans earlier. Um, Chris Ledoux had a version of it, and Kyle Evans who is just, was a wonderful, wonderful singer. And again, about people not knowing what happens right. with their song. Eight years, eight years after Kyle Evans had died in a tragic motorcycle accident. I was in Des Moines, Iowa at a horse show. Oh, okay. And we had a booth in it, and there was a guy there who has now become a good friend of mine. That was our initial meeting. Right. He was selling saddles and whatever, and right. so we had a corner of this huge building where we were doing our thing. They had some um, chorus bleachers right. kind of uh, surrounding this, blocking off this one little area. People could come by and hear a singer, they could go shopping for horse stuff. And he came over and he said, uh, uh, he, he, had the, he had a CD. Or, well, I don't, no, he didn't have a CD. But he told me about Kyle. I didn't right. know who Kyle was. Right. And he said, do you know that I was just a guy in South Dakota who has recorded both those two songs right. you just did, uh, 10 Seconds in the Silent Jeans and Good Leather? I said, no. But I found out about Kyle Evans. Right. Uh, his Christmas album is incredible. Right. He has a gospel album that is incredible. He sang mostly cowboy stuff, right. but he could sing anything. Right. Just a wonderful voice, um, and uh, as I say, this was eight years after he had died that I even knew that he had recorded these songs. Wow. So, um, and this song, thanks again to Chris Ledoux and Kyle Evans, has, uh, as I understand, is sung at these cowboy Festivals, cowboy. So music. you have several, several of your songs that 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 are popular. At, at well, at least these two, at yeah. least ten seconds in the saddle and right. jeans and good leather. Right. Um, so we were, um, so we re-recorded it for this second time around album. Uh, Charlie McCoy did the harmonica intro right. to this song, and we were, of course. Very glad to have him on this session. So, let's listen to Jeans and Good Leather. 